Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing, well, it's actually tonight, but I'm going to be doing a requested video and it's on, um, my perfumes. It was a requested perfume collection video. Now, I do have to say that basically almost all of my perfumes are knockoff versions, um, purchased at either the dollar store or, um, five and below. I do have a couple name brand ones, but that's pretty much it. So I'm just so gonna get started. The first perfume, the first perfume I'm gonna show you is from Britney Spears, and it's um the original Fantasy, and it comes in this pretty pink bottle, and it has like little green green um gems over it, like rhinestones all over the bottle. And it's like a round bottle, and it has this little pink um detail there, and then like a little ball cap. Um. And this smells amazing, like, I don't know, like, I've had this for a while, I've had this for like two or three years, so like, the pump doesn't really work anymore, like, yeah, it doesn't work anymore, I think it's clogged, which is fine, I, I like, I like keeping the bottle anyway, and as you can see, I had a little bit left, um, it smells amazing, it smells like, to me, like, after it wears off for a little bit, it smells like, like a cotton can, like a cotton candy or like a can, a sweet scent, but like, right now it smells amazing, but yeah. So, that's that. And I got this at Walmart for Christmas in, like, a little set for, like, 10 or $20. So, that's that one. Um, the next one I got, my husband actually got this for me for our first Christmas, I believe. Back in 2006. So, I've had this for a while, too. Um, I actually just recently found it because I couldn't find it for the longest time. And it's the Britney Spears, um, Curious, so as you can see, Britney Spears, and it's the actual Britney Spears, it's a small one, oh, and I forgot to mention, um, this fantasy one is one fluid ounces, so, a pretty big size bottle, right? And this is Eau de Parfum, I think that's, like, concentrated more, but anyways, um, this one is Britney Spears Curious, and I love the bottle, it's so adorable, and it came with, like, this little charm. It's like a heart, two heart, like crystal hearts, and then like three like little diamonds. I don't know if you can see that, but um, this one is 0.5 fluid ounces, so it's like half an ounce. And surprisingly, this this one still um, sprays, but I'm not gonna spray because I don't want like the whole room smelling like um, different perfumes. Um, this is kind of like a fresh scent. I don't know, it smells really good. I'm very, very bad at um, describing scents, so sorry if I like chop it up or just like I'm horrible at it. Um, but yeah, it smells really good. Um, sorry I'm saying I'm a lot. <laughs> but yeah, it just smells really good. And it's just a blue bottle. Looks like one, like one of the old fashioned ones. And it just has like the little topping. So, that is that. And it says that it is, it's good for 36 months, but if I've had it since 2006 and it still smells good, that's pretty amazing. So, that best Next one that's well. an actual, um, name brand is Curve Crush. And, um, I got this from my husband's grandmother. She didn't like it because sh she said it smelled like like, too young for her, but, it was, hey, free perfume, and they're all, like, little dusty. Um, this one, I wouldn't say it's, like, florally, but it's, I don't know, it has, like, a certain smell to it, and this one is 3.4 fluid ounces, so for free, like, that's amazing, and again, it's Curve Crush, and I get, like, compliments on this all the time, like, one time I was at Olive Garden, and this, like, our waiter just smelled me, and she's like, is that Curve Crush? I was like, yeah. So I was like, that's cool. Um, but yeah, as you can see, I still have a lot left, but I did use a pretty good amount. So, that's all the name brand ones, which is three, but what are you gonna do? I have one from the dollar store, and it's the Jean-Philippe Paris version of Paris Hilton by Paris Hilton. Um... That's what it looks like. It's just like a plain bottle like that. And 
I don't know. As you can see, I don't really use it that often. I mean, like, in the bottle, it doesn't smell too good, but once you spray it and it, like, fades a little, it smells, like, really good. It smells florally. Like, very florally. But, yeah. Um, I did have the Juicy Couture, Juicy Couture one, but I didn't really like that one. I wanted to get the Viva Le Juicy, but they never seem to have it when I want it. Or when I go in there and get it. Or go in there to look for it. So, yeah. That's from the dollar store. A dollar. And that is 2.5 fluid ounces. And this is Udo whatever. It's the toilet one. So I'm thinking that's like not as concentrated. So now the next uh, five are from Five and Below. Um, I got this actually last year before my wedding. And it's um, Vera Wang's Princess. Well, it's their version of Vera Wang Princess. It's called Precious. And as you can see, I really didn't use a lot of it because, I don't know, at one point, like, it just gave me a headache, but now smelling it again, like, I really want to start using it again. <laughs> and then, it has, like, a sweet scent to it. Um, I smelled the Vera Wang, the actual Vera Wang Princess, and this is actually pretty close to it, so, yeah, five dollars, you can't beat it, and I forget how many ounces this was, because these don't have, like it on it like it had on the box but I threw that out because I like I said I got it last year so that's that one um here's another one I've had for a while and it's the five and below version of Britney Spears circus fantasy so as you can see I love like the Britney Spears um perfumes and that's just what it looks like and as you can see I used quite a bit of it. Um, I just stopped using this for a while because I think this is when like fades really fast and like after like a couple hours you can't even smell it anymore. So it smells pretty good. It smells like any if you've smelled the Britney Spears circus one. Like I said I'm horrible at describing scents unless like I can actually see like the description. Yeah. So this is supposed to be Britney Spears Circus Fantasy. And now I'm going to get into some newer ones I got. Um, this is also from Five and Below. And this is where I think they started printing, like, um, like how many ounces is in it and all that other stuff. So this is called Tokyo Doll. And this is supposed to be their version of Gwen Stefani, one of the Harajuku lovers, um, scents. And it is an Eau de Parfum, which is concentrate, I think. So, this one is 3.4 fluid ounces, so that's pretty good for, um, $5. As you can see, I used a lot of it, but I still have a lot left, so that's pretty good. Um, but yeah, this one is very perfumey, um... There's a little floral to it, but it's very perfumey. I really like it, though. Um, yeah. That one. And then this one, I've always talked about this. This has been one of my favorites, like, forever now. And it's the, it's called Meow, and it's an art, it do perfume. Sorry if I'm butchering the name, or however you say it. And this is also 3.4 fluid ounces, and it's, um, Meow. It's their version of Katy Perry's Purr, and I actually want to get the actual version because this one smells so good. And if it smells anything like this, that's going to be amazing. But I think I'm good on perfume for right now. Um, but as I said, I use this one a lot, and this is more concentrated. It doesn't, like, fade really fast either. And as you can see, I use, like, a lot. Like, I'm trying to... Um, conserve this one too but another one's taking its place right now because I'm like obsessed with it and I'll get into that in a minute but I can't really describe how it smells it just smells good I'll just leave it at that it smells good so this brings me to my last and newest purchase um I've been eyeing this one for a while well I've been debating on getting it for a while and it's called sweet candy for women and it's in another uh 
Eau de Par Parfum, and it's 3.4 fluid ounces. So basically, the ones that um five and below are 3.4 fluid ounces. Um, and this is what it looks like. It's their version of Pink Sugar, and I love like um cotton candy scents, sweet scents, you name it. So that's what that looks like. It's in a nice sized bottle and as you can see I used just a little bit because I just got this but I use it almost every day and to me it smells like kind of like cotton candy but and bubblegum put together but also it's like a perfumey scent like it's like a not heavy but like it's not like light it's I guess heavy but not in a bad way but it's really really good I'm actually going to spray some because I love it but yeah I love it. And <laughs> when I first put it on, <laughs> my husband was like, you smell like a pop, or you smell like my favorite um, ice pop. I was like, it's this. He's a, And he likes it, so that's pleasant. He usually doesn't like, like, some perfumes, so I was like, happy. So those are like the actual perfumes. Um, I do have body sprays that I use. Um, let me see if I can find them. Like, I used the Bath and Body Works. Like, I used, um, mint, uh, what's it called? Dark Kiss for a while, but I ran out of that. And I also gave one to my friend because I wanted to switch it up. And I've been using, um, Bath and Body Works Warm Vanilla Sugar, but that was because I used that as a room spray. There's also another one the body that fragrance I used. It's tattooed it's by Inky, and it's in Koi. It looks like that. Um, I don't know, it just smells really good. And this is in 8.5 fluid ounces. I found it at Target for like $8. My husband actually bought this because he thought like, like it's a universal scent, but it's for women. But he thought it smelled really good, so he picked it up because he th thought he could use it, but it's for women. So he gave it to me. So it all works out. And then the two, um, body fragrant or body splashes body sprays, I don't know, whatever, um, they're from Body Fantasies, and like I said, I love cotton candy and candy scents, so this one is the Body Fantasies Cotton Candy Fantasy, that smells like that, and it smells like straight up cotton candy, like, it's sugary and sweet, and I love it, and when you spray it, it, like, definitely lingers and stays, and then another one I really like is that I like musk. So this is um, Fresh White Musk Fantasy, and these are just 1.7 fluid ounces. It came with another one, and, but I don't really like that one because it's like too heavy. Um, but yeah, I think I got these for Christmas one year for my uncle last year, I think. And it came in a set of three, but I just kept these two because I like them. So, yeah. That's my perfume splash um, body spray collection. If buying new perfumes, it feels like so. My collection's always um, expanding. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Like, comment, subscribe, and have a good day.